Did you know that some tractor owners fill their tires with water or other fluids? Filling tractor tires with water is a common practice in agriculture and certain industrial applications, serving various purposes. But why would you fill your tires with water? Well, the primary reason for filling tractor tires with water include improving stability and traction. This practice is prevalent in agricultural tractors used for tasks like plowing, planting, and harvesting, as well as in industrial tractors involved in material handling, construction, and other heavy-duty operations. The added weight from water enhances the tractor's stability by lowering its center of gravity. This is particularly important in situations where tractors may encounter uneven terrain. The increased weight also contributes to better traction, preventing slippage, especially in challenging conditions like muddy or slippery surfaces. One of the key benefits of water-filled tires is the counterbalance they provide, particularly for tractors equipped with front-end loaders. These loaders can create an imbalance, and water-filled tires help offset this weight, reducing the risk of the tractor tipping forward when lifting heavy loads. Another advantage is the reduction of soil compaction. Water-filled tires distribute the weight more evenly over the tire's footprint, minimizing the impact on the soil. This is crucial for maintaining soil structure and fertility in agricultural settings. The practice is not limited to agricultural tractors. It extends to industrial and forestry tractors as well. In industrial settings, water-filled tires aid in the material handling and improve stability during loading and unloading. In forestry applications, where off-road capabilities are vital, water-filled tires help tractors navigate challenging terrains. Filling tires with water is a cost-effective way to add weight to the tractor. Water is readily available and less expensive than alternative ballast materials. Additionally, some tractors may use other substances, such as calcium chloride or antifreeze solutions for additional weight, especially in cold climates where water-filled tires might freeze. But is it only water you can fill it with? No. Tractor tires can be filled with various fluids, known as ballast fluids, depending on the specific needs and operating conditions. In addition to water, common alternatives include calcium chloride, which provides increased weight and is particularly useful in cold climates due to its lower freezing point. Antifreeze solutions such as ethylene glycol are employed for their antifreezing properties and weight. Brine solutions, a mixture of water and salt, offer additional weight and some anti-freezing benefits. Beet juice mixed with water has gained popularity as an environmentally friendly alternative, providing weight and anti-corrosive properties. Polyurethane foam can be injected into tires, offering a more permanent solution without the risk of fluid leakage. Methanol, with its lower freezing point, is occasionally used as a ballast fluid to provide added weight. The choice of ballast fluid depends on factors such as climate, application cost, and environmental considerations. It's essential to adhere to the manufacturer's recommendations and guidelines to ensure compatibility with the tractor's specifications and tire construction. Ultimately, selecting the appropriate ballast fluid enhances traction, stability, and overall performance in diverse agricultural, industrial, and forestry applications. But what are the downsides of it? While filling tractor tires with fluids like water or ballast materials provides benefits such as improved stability and traction, there are downsides to consider. One concern is corrosion, particularly with water, as it can contribute to rusting of rims and other metal components within the tire, potentially leading to increased maintenance costs. Freezing is another issue with water-filled tires in cold climates, necessitating the use of alternative ballast fluids like calcium chloride or antifreeze solutions. Repairing a fluid-filled tire can be more challenging than fixing a standard air-filled tire, and there's a risk of difficulty in tire repair. The increased weight from fluids can result in higher rolling resistance, leading to reduced fuel efficiency, especially on hard surfaces. Additionally, the environmental impact is a consideration, as spills of certain ballast fluids may harm the surroundings. To mitigate these downsides, careful consideration of the tractor's specific requirements, intended application, and environmental conditions is necessary. Regular maintenance and proper handling of fluids can help extend tire life and minimize potential issues. But are there any alternative ways? The use of ballast in front or on the back of the tractors serves as an alternative to water-filled tires and plays a pivotal role in optimizing tractor performance. 
The big box you may have noticed in front of a tractor is likely a ballast box, strategically designed to add weight to the front of the tractor, addressing several crucial purposes. This becomes particularly important during various tasks where heavy implements or uneven terrain pose a risk of the rear wheels losing contact with the ground. The primary function of ballast is to prevent this by providing extra weight, ensuring that all four wheels stay firmly on the ground. Determining the appropriate amount of weight to add in the ballast depends on various factors, including consulting the tractor's manual, considering the type of job being done, understanding the need for weight distribution between the front and back, and accounting for factors like soil surface, implement type, travel speed, and tire size. While not all tractors necessarily need ballast weights, their necessity varies based on factors like task intensity, terrain characteristics, and implement weight. Tractors engaged in heavy-duty tasks, operating on slopes, or pulling large implements benefit significantly from ballast to ensure stability and prevent tipping. The manufacturer's recommendations provided in the tractor's manual are crucial for determining the optimal ballasting strategy based on design, intended use, and safety considerations. And there you have it. Now you know why some tractor tires are filled with water, what the benefits are, the downsides, and alternatives to it. We hope you learned something new and were entertained. If you enjoyed this, you might also enjoy this video. Thanks for watching, and remember to subscribe for much more.